Well, hello everyone, this is Leo. Today I will show you how you can use the new Saigon tool to jailbreak any iDevice running iOS 8 to iOS 13. This jailbreak even works on the new iOS 13 perfectly. As per the device requirement, it is compatible for all the iDevices. The tool will itself check the iOS version of the device you are using and will jailbreak it accordingly. I will be using iPhone 11 for the demo. Here you can see the post jailbreak result on my iPhone where I was able to install this custom theme using Cilio. All right, let's jailbreak this thing. Open the Safari or Chrome browser and visit this site, ijbsaigon.com. This is the official site for Saigon jailbreak. Now just follow along with what I'm doing. Here you can see the version of iOS installed on your device. For me, it's the latest one. Now, click on this Download JB button and it will start the jailbreak process. You can see the list of compatible devices below and also the list of bug fixes and new updates. All right. The major requirement for this jailbreak is the device ID of your iPad or iPhone. The jailbreak won't be completed without this ID, so the tool will first try to get this ID automatically via port 7809. Much of the time, this port is blocked, like on this iPhone. However, on my other iPhone, it took the device ID automatically via port 7809. But since I wanted to show you the other possibility, I am using this phone where this port is blocked. Here we need to manually get the device ID. So there are some specific apps on the App Store that have a built-in function of returning device ID to the iOS kernel. All you need to do is just follow the instructions given here. Once you perform the instructions correctly, it will return the device ID to the iOS kernel, which will be grabbed by Saigon JB to complete the jailbreak process. So you're probably wondering why you need to follow these instructions. Well, every app on the App Store has a feature of checkpoints. So every app in the App Store has a series of checkpoints which tell us if the app has been successfully deployed or, in simple words, installed on the device. Once this checkpoint is complete, it will perform some specific task. In the case of the apps shown here, they return the device ID to the iOS kernel as an indication of successful installation. Saigon has the ability to grab this device ID from the iOS kernel so that it will do our job. I know, it's a lot of technical stuff, just don't worry and follow along with what I'm doing. Once you have chosen the app, click OK and you will be redirected to the App Store. Here, you just need to download the app. Then open it and perform the instructions given to you so we can complete the checkpoint the app requires and then it will return the device ID to the kernel. After performing the instructions, just go back to the browser and check the status. As you can see, it is grabbing the device ID now. Now it's verifying the ID and completing the jailbreak. There you have it, the jailbreak is successful. Now just give us some time to install Cilio. All right, Cilio is installed, however, we need to restart the phone once, so let's do that. Okay, 
I have restarted my phone, and there is Cilio. So go ahead and tweak your iPhone and iPad. You definitely deserve all that customization. Let me just quickly install a custom theme. Click on this Get button, and then install the theme. Once it's installed, the device will respring. And now you can go to settings. Snowboard and apply the downloaded theme. There it is. It looks really cool. So this is how you can jailbreak the new iOS 13 and install working Cilio. So if you have any questions, just comment below and I'll try my best to help you. Be sure to like this video and subscribe. Thanks for watching. Bye.